To Guatemala now, the aftermath of that volcanic eruption, search teams are still desperately looking for nearly 200 people reported missing. At least 75 people are dead. And this morning, we're learning students and leaders from Valor Christian High School in Highlands Ranch were in Guatemala when the volcano erupted. They haven't left yet. Denver 7 reporter Eric Lufer has been in contact with one of those members of that group. And Eric, what are you learning? Well, first of all, they're all okay in nearby Antigua. The students and leaders are doing volunteer work and learning Spanish. Now, I'm told the group was never in the direct path of the eruption. They were on a field trip at the time of that. I've been talking with Laura Cooper of Aller alum and co-leader of the trip over Facebook. She writes, at the moment of the eruption, volcanic ash began to rain down from the sky, and then the smoke covered the sun and became as dark as night, even in Antigua, 11 miles away. Cooper says a host dad is a doctor and is volunteering right now as an emergency medic. Cooper also says only first responders and certain aid groups are allowed in the affected area, but they hope to go as a group later this week to a shelter where it said 150 children are housed who have been separated from their parents. Unbelievable. Laura is asking for prayers for the team. She says for many of the students, this is the first time they've experienced a real trauma. Mitch. 